Hi everybody, uh, S Reinhardt 88 again, Jimmy again, here doing our second video. Next up we have the Peach Ghost. Pretty rad looking ghost here. And Mustard Ghost. Not as not as wrinkly, but still pretty crazy looking. Um, I've never had a ghost. Uh, I hear it's a very different heat than say you get with a, a habanero or something like that or a fatale. It's a different kind of heat. Fun fact, so, I also have never had a ghost. That's yeah, very Just true. That uh, is putting out there. Now, heat level wise, the, the seven pot was you know pretty close. Oh, really? Okay. Um, roughly. <laughs> so we have a theory. Um, and I feel ashamed that in our last video, our first video, um, Jim went for milk pretty quick. Not too surprised. No offense. I waited, and then I kind of dove for the milk. But that's because we had it sitting right here next to us. Now, I'm thinking if we put the milk way over there, and it's out of sight, out of mind kind of thing, uh, it's not going to be so much torture knowing that relief instead of being right in front of us is going to be somewhere where we can't get to it. Hopefully it's going to be a little better. We're going to experiment. We'll try it out. Um, we have a coin, a quarter here. Uh, thank you, Candace. Thank you, Candace, for your quarter. So, to decide who gets which pepper, uh, because I only have one of each. Or I, I have a smaller peach ghost, so it wouldn't be fair for one of us to get the small one and one of us to get the larger one. Um, heads is going to be the mustard. And tails is going to be peach. Uh, Jimmy, make your call. I mean, just no, I, I guess. We should have decided that already. I'm bad yeah. at coin flips. I was just thinking coin flips are so easy. Yeah, flip a coin. All right, how about we flip the head tails? All right, all right. Okay, so for, first he, off, heads, heads is you, tails is me. Yes. And then and then we'll do it again. So first, and then whoever, whoever goes gets gets for first uh, first flip, then becomes heads for mustard, tails for peach. Say that again. So, you flip a coin uh -huh. one time, first time. Uh -huh. You flip it two times all together. Okay. First time is decide who you and me. Okay. Decide and the then the second one is to decide which pepper to get. Fair enough? Yes. So, you're going to narrate my flip. I'm just going to flip. Fair enough. Alright. Okay. Um. Definitely editing that whole clip out. We might have a blooper reel. I think it's a pretty cool idea. Um, all right, so we're gonna have a coin flip. Uh, thanks again to the great state of Kansas for letting us borrow your quarter. Um, so first flip is Jim to decide uh, who gets or who who it is. Like tails would be me, heads would be him. Okay. So and then we'll go flip the coin a second time. And that will decide who gets what uh, pepper, or who the, the, the person that was already, already decided by the coin flip gets what which pepper. So yes, heads, no, I, I I understand. Heads is mustard. It, it took me a minute peach. to get it. So all right. So first flip. Yep. And it's heads, which would be me. You vote. Okay. So what pepper do I get? Heads is going to be mustard. Tails is going to be peach. And I get mustard. I get peach. And Jimmy gets peach. Uh, thank you, Kansas, for deciding this for us. I've never been to Kansas. Too many times I've stayed in Kansas. <laughs> Kansas is just a dry state. All right. Sorry for people that so like I'm Kansas. I'm gonna pick the stem off your peach for you. Here you Trying to smell it a little bit. Now I'm curious. The mustard ghost is a very interesting shade of puke green yellow I haven't heard anything about the flavor of it um, I'm curious so I'm gonna cut mine in half you want me cut I think we should cut yours in half yeah, yeah this one. that's a cool looking yeah. can't wait to see the inside of this guy oh yeah I do I don't have gloves either this yeah, is I can't touch my face. brilliant you can't touch anything I can't touch my, my hands oh well, that's unfortunate. Um, bad peach? As you can see, Jimmy's is bad. It's got a whole bunch of nasty brown spots in it. 
Uh, so we're going to go with, I guess, the other peach ghost that I have. I am going to cut into my mustard ghost as Jimmy examines his decaying peach. There is one half my mustard ghost. It's a big pod too. I was kind of hoping I got the peach. Um, don't really see too much oil in here, but you know, that nice thick vein of capsaicin running through the middle of it. Okay, uh, let's find another pepper for Jimmy. So, okay, um, little technical difficulties here. Uh, Jimmy's pepper, original pepper, was bad. He's still going to go with the peach ghost. I think this is a peach ghost. I know it doesn't have that elongation that a ghost normally does. Um, but I almost distinctly remember picking it off of that row with the peach ghost. So uh, that's going to be Jimmy, so let's cut that open and see what he's got waiting for him. That's a shame, because that first peach looked really good, too. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know? What? That... This yeah. one's bad, too. I don't know if you can really tell, but yeah, obviously at that dark spot. I'm pretty sure that's not right. Um... Yeah, that's bad. Take three. Jimmy's gonna go for the small one. Jimmy gets the tiny peach ghost. Um, it's really odd. I don't know why those first two peach ghosts had that discoloration in. It looked like it was rotting. But if this one has it, then it's so If this one has it, you're just gonna have to make up your mind and see which one you want. Or I'll make you eat all three. You know... It's disappointing. You, you probably really can't even tell, but it's got those brown spots in it again. Okay, so back again. Um, for some reason, all three of the peach ghosts that I picked had a lot of brown spots in it, and the seeds looked just really bad. Uh, I didn't trust it, so we're going to give Jim another pepper. Um, we're going to let Kansas decide again. Let's see what Jimmy gets. And it is Barack Poor for Jimmy. Uh, and I'll have to look up later how many Scovels that is, because I don't know off the top of my head. Let's cut that open. Uh, and if I get Ooh. another bad pepper... Ooh. Does this smell bad? No, it just... Some of those are bad. Hmm. Okay. I don't know why he's got a really bad bit. Cut this open for Jimmy. Oh, come on. Really? Yeah. The set of the fates do not want me to eat a pepper. Another. You can't really see it on the side. Yes, I get it. Let's see if I turn the light on. It has. That's too bright. You know, you see the dark seed right there. But even some of the flesh is kind of dark and spotted. Okay, let's try the chocolate ghost, and if it happens this time, I don't know what we're going to do. You could just go right for the reaper. Bad chance. <laughs> it's been decided. I'm leaving. Goodbye. The pepper gods have decided that Jimmy does not want to eat peppers. No. Um, because we just cut open the chocolate ghost... A supposedly chocolate ghost. Um, and again, it's just dark and kind of rotted. Okay. Let's try it one more time here. Okay. Um, I don't even know what take we're on now. Um, <laughs> this uh, is... Pie? Probably. I think this is Devil's Tongue. Let's see, now it's got the green... No, that's just a green spot. That's not a brown spot. And, uh, I'm going to cut this open for Jim. Looks promising. I'll also have to go and look up how hot the... Alright, that one's doable. <laughs> Finally. The inside... Oh man, a little bit of oil in there. 
inside of Jimmy's devil's tongue here. Oh, I dropped seeds on my laptop. <laughs> okay. Finally, your pepper, sir. It awaits. Are we looking it up now? The devil's tongue? How hot is it? Uh, it's the devil's tongue at above 500 degrees. Okay, so you're still getting some heat. Oh, which is good. It means I'm not alone. Okay. Let me, let me smell this mustard. I'm really... Yeah, look at, look at I'm almost look. apprehensive about this. Oh, this tongue. Just because I don't know how the flavor is going to be. But that smells like it's going to be really good. It smells like a hot pepper. I that doesn't really have a distinctive. Ooh. That's Ooh. Like it's gonna be big it actually smells like it's burning. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're gonna have fun with that. Yes. Tomorrow, my intestines will all forgive me. Yeah, well, that's another story. Well, just shirting. Sure We're not having that review. No. <laughs> um, okay, so here we are, uh, almost 20 minutes in, finally eating our peppers. It has been decided I have a mustard ghost, and Jim has what I believe is a red devil's tongue. Big <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> you better pick that up for my caddy to yeah. the whole pepper. Okay. <laughs> Almost kind of sweet. in my throat. I don't want to talk. I don't want to risk it. This one. Oh. It's hot. <coughs> you alright, Jim? Oh, wait, no. I feel like I got gypped. Unless the ghost heat like creeps up on you. I feel it on my tongue a little bit. Only on that. Um. I don't know what for. It's really hot. It's creeping on my tongue. This is super hot. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Jimmy. This is the worst. <laughs> It's sinking in on my tongue now. It's all in my tongue. Um, and flavor wise, like I said, almost kind of sweet. Um, yeah, I, I don't know what else to say about it, really. It's definitely on my tongue now. But I mean, it's, it's bearable. Look, I feel like I handled the Jamaican hot chocolate worse. So maybe it's my. Uh, Milk theory, although Jimmy has that over here now, so. It's all on my tongue. But it's sinking in now, that's for sure. Okay. It's so hot. Get the ice cream, Jim. Oh my god. I can't do it. I bequeath to you a spoon. <laughs> okay. It's definitely sunk in now. Um, gave me a lot of time to enjoy the flavor. Eyes are watering a little bit. <sighs> Jimmy's dying. Poor Jimmy. For the record, disclaimer, he volunteers for this stuff. Yeah, yeah, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> it's hot. People said the ghost had a very aggressive burn. I don't get it. It took a while. Delayed. Um, prepped its way in. I feel it in my ears again. Oof. 
Have a seat, Jim. Mm. Mm. I can't, dude. I'm not kidding you. Okay. I'll be right back. I'm going to go open the ice cream for Jimmy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. chunk in my throat. How do you open this? Trash cans over there, dude. Ooh. Mm. You ever spoon? Mm. Eat this right now. Mm. Or open up the door and puke out the stairs. I don't think Jimmy's going to make it, folks. Okay. Uh, so Jimmy's not handling it well, unfortunately. I sure hope that was a devil's tongue. I'm going to feel really bad if I gave him something that was really, really hot. Uh, now luckily, and I don't think he'll agree to it, tonight at least, we still have our reaper. That'll be fun. Um, I don't know what to say about this one. There really wasn't, I mean, it was a burn. It was hot. Um, but not as feared as, you know, people always make it out to be. I really want to know what I gave Jimmy now. Um, if anybody knows, if anybody can identify that, uh, post it in the comments, I guess. Hmm. The ice cream makes it all better. Okay. Um, I didn't even really need the ice cream. Um, it helped, don't get me wrong. Um, but it really wasn't bad. I honestly think I reacted to the Jamaican hot chocolate a little worse. Um, I'm going to go check on Jimmy, guys. Um, as soon as he calms down, we'll have a, uh, a recap. So we'll see you back here in a minute or two. Um, so Jimmy has had some time to recover. Um, I'm perfectly fine. Jimmy is still kind of feeling it. Um, I'll go first, and then we'll divulge Jimmy's story a little bit. Um, the heat on the Mustard Ghost definitely was, it, it was, it really, it wasn't there for the first, like, minute. So I got a good time to experience that flavor. Um, and obviously it, it didn't taste like mustard. I don't think I expected it to, but it didn't taste like mustard. Um, I really, I don't know how to describe it. It was, it was a little sweet. It was, it was definitely sweet. Um, and then after I chewed it up pretty good and swallowed it, um, the heat kicked in and started on my tongue and basically went right on my tongue. Um, got my throat a tiny bit. Uh, but a lot of it was on my tongue. It really wasn't that bad. It went away pretty quickly as well. Um, so I'm almost kind of disappointed. Uh, but it was still a good pepper. But it just wasn't what I thought it was going to be. 
Now, with Jimmy, I initially said that he was doing a red devil's tongue. Um, upon further research, it turns out I may have accidentally given him a red Brock board. So, while we should have been on the same heat levels, uh, he clearly got on the higher levels of that heat than I did. Um, he had a lot of dairy. Yeah. Um, but he didn't throw up, which is good. Um, so, yeah, go, go ahead, Jim. Inform us. Uh, well, it started off alright. <clears throat> I, I feel I lost a bunch of, like, I, cause I had... I don't know if you if you heard or saw it or if it's any kind of video. A little bit. But uh I was gonna waste my clutch too. Sure. Um It I feel like I, I kinda sort of left you know, left a seed pod. Not a seed pod, but yeah, yeah actually a seed pod, yeah. A little like a few seeds kinda of might have fallen out in like a little cluster on the floor. I still haven't found it. I don't know. Um but uh it was citrusy. It's kind of fruity. It was pretty good at first. Uh, the first uh, three seconds or so. I'm about to say, it, it didn't seconds. take long for that heat to kick in. And you then were... it instantaneously set my entire mouth on fire. Uh, not sure exactly what that was or how it... That's how called it, capsaicin. Well, capsaicin, yeah. But <laughs> it, it just burned. Was it like all over your mouth? It's like your throat? Oh, yeah. It was, was, it it was, it was, it was, it was all over my mouth. Uh, it kept to say that on my third thing, believe as if, if Ooh, that man. had happened. Uh, I, mm, I, I probably would have thrown it up, to be honest. Uh, it, as soon as it hit my tongue, again, it was it was really nice, fruity, kind of citrusy t uh, taste to it. But again, as soon as that three to five second, you know, time, you know, it felt like forever. <laughs> I did cut the top off there is that little tiny bit left I'm not, that. I'm not gonna eat it but well, yeah. I'm curious it's a good pepper I kinda wanna eat it sure, go for I it. don't wanna drop it it, it spreads around real fast it smells really good yeah it's it, it's it a, smells good it's a good pepper it's just hot Okay. It's really hot, really fast. Well, I'll tell you what, Jimmy. As an apology to Jimmy for accidentally giving him uh, something a lot hotter than what he was expecting, uh, and out of my own curiosity, I am going to eat just this tiny little sliver that remains of the Barack Corps. Also, the vacuum is here. Very interesting flavor, you're right. Mm -hmm. And then, well, you wouldn't mean you won that cake, because it's not that much. No, I still got the top. There's some capsaicin in there, probably. Okay, A little fruity. Very fresh taste. That's a very fresh taste. It's an afternoon. Almost smoky, maybe? Mm. Just a little bit of burn. I don't, I don't think there was enough capsaicin on there for it to really do anything. I'll give it a second just to see if it kicks in. No, it's, it's got a, I'm a tingle in my tongue. It's really nothing major. Um, but I agree with Jimmy. Very good flavor. Very good tasting pepper. Um, guess that's about it. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Why would you smell it? It still smells bad. Like, it's still yeah, smells no shit smells bad. I mean, it's all good. Yeah, that's just another part one of that.
That was a terrible flip.